Hello, it's Ozzy here bringing you my favorite 22 Windows shortcuts that you cannot live without. Some of these you may already know, but I'm certain some will be a surprise to you. Let me know in the comments below which surprised you, and remember if you find this video helpful to give me a like and subscribe. And as always, I'll be moving through these pretty fast, so check the description for timestamps. So without further ado, let's get into the video. We're going to start with some of the more commonly known shortcuts, how to copy, cut and paste in and out of your clipboard. Control C will copy a selected item, Control V will paste that selected item, and Control X will cut a selected item. We all know the print screen button on our keyboard will grab a screenshot of everything and put it into our clipboard. But did you know if you press Windows print screen, it will save the screenshot into your pictures folder. Now it's pretty inconvenient to be print screening your entire desktop as you end up print screening all your active monitors. Well, did you know that by pressing Alt print screen, you only print screen the active program. I'm sure many people are aware that the Windows snipping tool allows you to quickly grab a screenshot of an area, edit it, etc. Did you know that by pressing Windows Shift S, you can get exactly the same functionality without having to open the program? Instead, it just puts it into your clipboard. Did you know by holding Windows key and any arrow key, you can move a window around different parts of your screen to allow you to stack it. Pressing down will minimize the program and pressing up continuously will full screen the program. Holding Windows and Shift key will allow you to switch the window from monitor to monitor. All right, I'm sure many of you are familiar with Alt-Tab for switching between active windows. But did you know you can press Windows-Tab to open Task Viewer? Task Viewer allows you to create new desktops and switch between those different desktops. You can open a new desktop with Windows, Control and D. And you can switch between these desktops by holding Control, Windows and using the arrow keys. You can remove desktops by pressing Controls, Windows, and F4. And this will close all active desktops if you keep pressing. It won't actually shut the windows, it will just merge the windows onto the next desktop. If you are like me and you pin Windows programs to your taskbar, you can launch them by pressing the Windows key and the relevant numbers. If the program's not already launched, it will launch it. Windows A will launch Control Center, not one I use often but still useful, and Windows L will lock your computer. Now Windows are getting rid of the arrow shake feature, which is when you can grab a window and shake it and it will minimize all other windows. Fortunately, we still have Windows D, which will minimize the desktop. So that does it. My favorite Windows shortcuts I could not live without. If you found this video helpful, please give it a like and whilst you're at it, subscribe for future videos. Also, if you knew all of those shortcuts, let me know down below. I'll be impressed. Catch you in the next one. Bye-bye.